and uh, a very commanding position ahead of the second leg. Yeah, it is just half time, but we're happy that we're in the position we're in at half time. So uh, we'll review it tomorrow, see where we can improve and, and get better and, and go and try and finish the job next week. How impressed were you by Hibernians in light of the fact that there was so much uncertainty about them? How competitive do you expect them to be next week? Yeah, I think we see in the second half what they'll bring next week. I think they'll be more direct. Uh, they'll have a lot more runners off the ball. And we've got to make sure we're ready for that. There was only one flashpoint in the game, uh, Rory Gaffney, the instant right in front of your dugout. Were you somewhat fortunate perhaps to finish the game with 11 men? I don't know. At the time I was talking, the fourth official said it was only a yellow card. Uh, so look, I have to see it back. A job well done and a fantastic night. Yeah, thank you. Rory, congratulations. A very commanding performance and a great lead to take into the second leg. Yeah, I think uh, third goal was vital. Um, they nearly scored, nearly made it 2-1 after I got the ball away, but thankfully we were able to get the third goal and make it an easier tie next week. How much pressure was on you as a group tonight? Because European football, it's really the stage upon which you're going to be measured. That's only probably the pressure that we put on ourselves. But obviously, we want to we wanna run in Europe. You know, it's the next thing that this, this team needs to do. But uh, we didn't know what they were going to be like, so I suppose it took us a few minutes to figure out what they were about and I suppose we were 2 nil up shortly after that. Can I ask you just the one incident in the second half, there's a lot of people might feel you were somewhat lucky to stay on the field to play, do you, do you feel it that way yourself? I, I definitely caught him but I didn't mean to catch him, I tried to get him off me but I didn't think I was obviously going to, I think I caught him in the chin or something but it was accidentally. Just a word on the balance of the tie now, it's a very strong lead to take into the second leg in light of the, the heat and the humidity that you'll face in Malta next week. Yeah, um, we were in Bratislava last year in Albania and it was very warm, so thankfully we have a Trina lead to take us with this, this time. And just a word again on the crowd, in excess of 7,000 and they played a massive role. Yeah, it's amazing. Uh, honestly, it's, it's unbelievable to be, to be playing in this stadium in front of, I suppose, crowds like this on, on nights like this. You're the man of the match tonight. Congratulations on that and congratulations on the lead you take into the second leg. Thanks. See you.